Hello people, I got a tutorial video to help you reduce the input lag of anniversary. As you guys may all know, if you're host, you won't get any lag, and if you're off host, you will get a lot of it. And I'm gonna help you out to reduce it, make, or to reduce it where it can be playable, at least. I don't know if it will be as smooth as playing the game by yourself or off host, but I'm sure these suggestions will probably help your gaming experience. And this might be, you know, a good video for you if you're just frustrated with the lag. Okay, the first thing you need to do is go to Anniversary Multiplayer Component, which is Halo Reach. Press Start on your controller. And go ahead, I mean, go to Network Status, status and check your NAT rating. Make sure it's open. If it's not, then make it open because I heard it kind of makes it more better. If you don't know how to open your NAT, then Google it. The second thing is make sure your sensitivity is 3 or... For anything higher than that is probably a bad idea because the sensitivity starts to get all wobbly. I play on 7 when I'm host or playing alone so if you play the same sensitivity as me or higher just lower it. The third thing is make sure the host is close to your area. If, you, if you're playing on like a Canada host and you're from Texas you're probably gonna lag really badly. I only recommend you to play it with a friend that lives in the same city as you do. Fourth thing is classic mode actually reduces the delayness a bit, not completely, but it does make it easier to um, move and control. However, you have to sacrifice the wonderful HD graphics that 343i did, so make your choice. The last thing you need to do is just get used to it. It's not impossible to adapt the delayness, but just try it. I'm sure after like 10 to 15 minutes, you'll be comfortable with it. And yeah. That's all you really gotta do to make the co-op experience more manageable. The main reason why it's so laggy is because Halo 1's netcode wasn't designed for online play, which is kind of the main reason why 343i didn't ship the multiplayer component of it. All the gameplay footages you're watching is me playing off host on Legendary, my friend was the host, and I would say I'm doing pretty fine, although this is really early in the game, so I was trying to get used to the controls and delayness. But once we got to um, the next level, Assault on the Control Room, I was completely used to it. It almost felt like playing, like, you know, the regular single player, but not really. But I was really used to the delayness, so yeah, it wasn't really an issue to me anymore. So yeah. I hope this video helped you get, helped you guys out and peace out. Come here, Banshee. Come here. Come here. Come here. Oh, what? Damn it! I'm not epic anymore. I'm going down anyways. I'm trying to. Oh, get stuck, son. Get stuck, son.